so y'all as you guys know your girl is officially eight months pregnant um who child this pregnancy has honestly flew by okay um it's not over yet obviously but i can honestly say that this whole entire pregnancy just went okay that's literally how my pregnancy went um of course now we're in the final stretch so getting everything packed up for the hospital um getting everything organized for baby royal just making sure that everything is set up properly for her and i did not want you guys to miss out on the nesting and all that that is going on currently um because of course before you bring a baby home you have so many different types of things that you have to do and being a pregnant woman i I didn't care how it got done. I just wanted it done. Okay. I don't like things laying around. I don't like things sitting around. If you know me, you probably already know that about me, right? So, um, my mom has been helping me out with a ton of different things, setting up different things. My dad also, which is Father's Day this month, so shout out to my dad. Um, but he's been helping with a ton of different things. So, we are just getting everything together for Baby Royal to come home and for her to be as comfortable as possible and for me to not have to rip through boxes and do all this extra stuff at the last minute so I did want to take you guys with me on my nesting journey share with you guys all the good stuff that's been going on all the new stuff that we have for baby girl and um, next month she'll be here all right y'all so I'm getting into nesting mode and my mom knew I wanted this so she ended up getting me this this is the diaper pill from skip hop and Look you guys, I'm so excited. So basically this is supposed to keep the odor of the diapers down. Um, of course, you know, throwing them out consistently will help to keep, you know, the odor of boo-boo down. But, um, still, it's great for in the middle of the night or whenever when you just don't feel like, you know, running and taking the outside or whatever the case may be. So, here it is. Ooh. It's actually a lot of space in there. You can put stuff in there. Yeah, like your changing stuff. Extra diapers. Mm -hmm. And you guys, I'm so excited because she also has her um, bassinet coming. Woohoo! So she'll have her bassinet and her crib for a lot of people that may be overkill. Not for my daughter. She can get everything. Okay. So. <laughs> I'll be letting you guys see that very, very soon. And what's well, this on top? Uh, that's how you open it up, if I can figure it out. Is that locked? Is this unlocked? Hold on. I'm not reading the instructions. Locked. What's up, Glam Stars? Sweet angel over here on Maggie's <laughs> Glam Life. Listen, y'all, I'm in grandmama mode. You know, my baby girl, she's nesting, and I'm going to be helping my baby girl something that you probably don't see on youtube much you know grandmamas grandmamas are players too hey hey oh well no <laughs> but anyway listen we finna get ready to get some of the stuff organized she's got so much stuff for little baby royal and oh, we gotta get busy it is now the end of may we don't have long we got about 53 days child you ain't gonna be overworking me in one day so today we get started let's get to it let me show you some new things that just came in we're excited listen we have been loving these little items with the crowns on them because guess what this crown represents miss royal and she's just definitely looks like she's already the little princess and she ain't even made her debut but boy she her name rings around these parts listen look what we got here the boppy head and neck support you gotta have it so we're gonna be taking a lot of things today probably starting to wash them out get them ready and prep for little miss royal so this is going to go in her car seat and I think we're going to get one for her swing as well. So we got to figure out how to organize all this good stuff. I think this goes around here and gets put into there so she can have neck support, which is very important for the babies, y'all, when they're first here. I think this is the way it goes. You know, I'm still, I'm still almost skilled at this kind of stuff, but, you know, not quite. 
<laughs> I think it goes something like that to support the neck. So I didn't close that up very well, did I? Well, anywho, lots of fun. And today is also a wonderful day because Grandpapa, Papa, he's been cooking. So Lil Royal and Maddie and myself, we've already eaten. It's a great day. And then we got pork chops, hamburgers, chicken. I got the ribs on the grill. And hey, we just, I'm gonna try to save this for the baby. But I'm saying <laughs> I got about a month and a half, so I might have to cook some more. And then to match that, look at here. The Boppy Original Support. This is for baby and mommy because guess what? She says she gonna do the nursing thing. She said, but if I don't use it for nursing mama, I'll use it just to hold her. Okay, <laughs> but this is so nice. But we are unpackaging things. I'm going to actually, this zips off y'all. There's a zipper right here and you take this off and we're going to wash it. Now I wanna know from anybody else. Now I hate these things right here. The tags, I hate them. This thing right here, I cut them off of everything it just gets in the way and I just don't like it but anywho we're going to be knocking out some things today getting rid of some of these boxes figuring out cabinet space and getting this all out of her hair so baby girl won't have to worry about this grandma's gonna take care of it okay she's spoiled I'm gonna keep her spoiled cuz she's my baby <laughs> she's my baby girl and if I don't, she's going Wait, to... Wait, which one of us are you talking I'm about? I'm talking here? about you. Oh. I'm talking about <laughs> you. You're my baby girl. And I don't want you stressing. I want to make sure that I'm here to help out. So, this is that. And I told y'all, days, if you've been watching my channel, how many days have I talked about preparing the baby bag, okay? Getting everything that's in there. Until I start packing it, I won't know what I need. Oh, what she needs. I am so obsessive, right? <laughs> All right, here's one of the baby bags. She actually has a brand deal that it's going to send her another baby bag that's really spacious. And when we take our road trip, we'll probably take that one. So let me, let me go ahead and open this up and I'll be right back to y'all. Well, it fooled us. This is super nice. You want to move around this side kind of so they can see the light a little bit. Look at there. And Maddie had said she wanted black. So I did get this one in black. And it's got the gold hardware on it. Really nice. Baby, this is this is stylish for 40 bucks. It's got a it's got a dust bag and everything. <laughs> okay. And it was actually in the registry. And I bought it off of Amazon. Love Vook. Okay, we're going to get ready to start seeing how much space we really have in here to put whatever we need. You know, good place for a pacifier. Good place for the bottles. Oh, look at there. Look, y'all, it's even insulated to keep the bottles at the temperature that they need to be. Okay, this will be the, the milk station right here. That's nice. Yes. Um, nice, sturdy straps, this cushion. So this is perfect. And I love the fact that all of it's wipeable. You know, you can just take a cloth and wipe off like one of the um, antibacterial wipe things we have to cleanse it off. And this is the diaper area back here for all diapering, diapers, you know, clothes, etc. Extras. So we're going to start packing her up. All right, Mama, where do you want to go next? And this is the baby's stroller. Miss Royal is riding in style. Car seat attached, stroller here, got everything we need, and we have also and some people have purchased some of these things from the registry we are already making use of them and we don't want to and we want to thank everybody who's been shopping so if y'all want to check out what is left go ahead look in the description box here and you'll find all of the rest of the goodies for baby yes this y'all I thought this was so cute and it's so us okay this is so us it says Please don't touch, please don't touch or kiss. Your germs are too big for me. <laughs> 
So this goes over the car seat. So when we're out and about, you know, you could drape it across or you could actually cover the entire thing up. So it depends on what you want to do with that. Made where she can breathe and it just hooks on the bottom like so. And it's like, oh, is it a baby in there? Uh-huh, it is a baby in here, okay? And that's what we do with that, okay? So we're all set. And we'll leave this here. And we got more to show y'all that we're up to today. This is Get It Right for Royal Day. All right, this is all stuff for me. This is like my breast pump. Um... And I have some breastfeeding bras and well not breastfeeding bras, but they go with the breast pump basically. This right here is more stuff for baby and me. So all this stuff was sent over for Royal by Nano Baby. So this is a box full of goodies, like pacifiers and things like that. Very nice stuff, you guys. So we're gonna get to opening this up. Oh, they have pacifier cases, or you can get like you know, some people can use Ziploc bags or they have little bags that have baby tings. <laughs> baby tings. I did say that. So we're going to check into that also, y'all. And um, right now we're just separating and dividing. We have this. This is a bottle cooler and travel pack. So I'm not sure if you want to keep it in there or just... No? Don't need it? Um. Don't know how you're going to be traveling? Who knows? I mean, you can always put it in in that bag. Okay. We need something. This is a little ice pack. Yeah. But I think, like, if you have any, like, formula, or put it in here. Or if you got your breast pack, you could as well. What's inside? We'll be eliminating all the things we don't need today. Well, check this out, y'all. FedEx just dropped this off. This is the Ventray Professional Electric Grill. Maddie wanted this so bad. All right, so this is one of Royal's shelves in the house. So up here is like her cameras um, for about her crib bottle what is that a bottle brush she has bottles up there different stuff bottle warmers so forth and so on she has some formula up there just a lot of stuff um her bottle sterilizer and all of that good stuff girlfriend so uh, that's our bouncer actually right there um so we have to get all of this down and opened up Uh, 
Alrighty, so Royal has her own little special place in the cabinet for her bottles and things like that, you guys. Um, I want to thank my mama so much for getting a lot of this stuff put up because y'all, when I talk about this back pain and this feet pain, honey, a lot of this stuff would have been getting done at the last minute and or it would have been getting done bit by bit piece by piece okay so um she knocked a lot of it out for me so i just want to say shout out to my mama um but yes you guys i think royal has more than enough bottles i don't know but if there's any other bottles that you guys recommend for baby royal down below let me know what are some of your faves what are some bottles that your baby absolutely loved i am interested in trying out quite a bit because i know some bottles work for certain babies and some don't so with that being said we're getting all this stuff put up you guys And this is the Dr. Brown's Bottle Sterilizer. Um, you guys, I wanted this so bad. It also dries the bottles after it finishes cleaning them. And you guys, I am so excited to use this. This was kind of like a test run that she just did here. Um, but I'm so excited to use this for baby girl's bottles to make sure that they're nice, so fresh, and so clean, clean for her. Um, but you can fit quite a bit of bottles in here. And they don't have to just be the Dr. Brown's brand um, because, as you guys saw, Roy has all types of different brands of bottles so um, she just threw a few of them in there and two of the tops and on the top you can also use it for pacifiers and things like that so you guys I think that this is an awesome purchase and I think that if you are a mom or if you are a parent period this is great okay if your children are still on bottles so, so you guys, I wanted this so bad and it was a great purchase. So this is a lot of Royal stuff that we're going to be washing on today. Um, these are just a few of her things, you guys. But we're trying to wash out quite a bit of things today. Um, up there is some onesies. Anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, these, all this stuff needs to be washed out. Y'all, I got pregnancy brain. My mind is like all over the place, but... We got to get this done nonetheless and we need to get our clothes washed out and we need to prep for baby girl for real for real Okay, so that's what we're doing on today um, So hopefully we can get quite a bit of things done These are all of her like newborn clothes, burp cloths, things like that. All this stuff needs to be washed. So we're about to throw this in the washer. We're going to use some good old baby drift. And um, we're going to use these scent boosters as well. Which we've been using these in our, our clothes. So yeah, that's why we got the big one. But anyway. Dump it all in. Dump it, dump, dump, dump it. And y'all, thank God for my mom because I have been having some sharp uterus clinchers. Okay. And I tell y'all, when I tell y'all, look at all those little socks out. No, it's always going to be one. Put the drift in. It's something in liquid isn't it Ew. No, it's not so good, you guys. and what's that wash so her grooming kit came y'all know you need this when you got a little baby okay um so and here you get all these goodies okay um so we have that right there what is it i can't see from behind the camera i don't know 
the mom runner? Okay, we know what that is. Girl. Oh, that's so nice. So many different things. What's that? Booger picker. You got the light on it. Stick it up their nose and hook that boogie. <laughs> okay. So, this is our task for today. We're about to set this up. Um, I went back and forth about the bassinet. Y'all know that. Um, because baby girl already has a crib. But, she has a bassinet too. So, we're about to set this up and get this ready for her. I wanted to share with y'all some more goodies that I got. Today is the next day actually from the last clip that you guys seen. And I have some more Huggies. Um, these are newborn size. Uh, like I said in the last clip I believe. These are good until they're up to 10 pounds. So she has quite a bit of boxes of the newborn um, diapers, Huggies, whatever. Witch Hazel wipes. Um, so there's two packs of these. Um, and they're just good for cooling off your hoo-ha, you know, after you give birth. Um, also, I have these here. These are the hot and cold postpartum therapy packs. Um, and these are also supposed to cool that thing off. Okay, because, you know, I heard it's, it's, it feels kind of interesting after you give birth. So, there you go. Um, also, this is the Dermoplas pain burn and itch um i think this is like a spray either way this is something else i'll be using after i get birth now i told you guys that i ordered some more gripe water this ended up coming in today so she has two more of those because gripe water is really good if your baby has colic um or you know they're having some type of stomach discomfort um or they're kind of fussy Grab water is amazing. Um, I also got this belly casting kit. My mom bought this and I am so happy about this you guys um, because we're going to get the belly casting done and kind of save with this moment of what size my belly is at this current moment in time which my belly is huge you guys so have this. Um, also have the, well I have these socks. Um, these are anti-slip socks, so as you guys can see, like they have the um, rubbery bottoms on it, on them, and I'll be wearing these more than likely around the hospital. Um, and then last but not least, you need these two, okay? So these are um, underwear, like pads, and they feel like fabric. So anyways, instead of having to wear like the big pads that they give you after giving birth, uh, you could just put this on and it's supposed to be discreet under your clothing, right? Uh, because y'all know after you give birth, you could be bleeding, you could be whatever, whatever. <laughs> so, I have all these goodies and I'm going to put most of them away. Um, I think these will more than likely be going in my hospital bag. Um, these for sure are going in my hospital bag. And uh, this, most of this stuff is going in my hospital bag. So, anyways, yeah, and I've already, um, well, my mom actually already put diapers in her diaper bags. Um, so, these will go up in the closet. Um, we haven't opened any of the boxes of newborn 
uh, diapers. We're just kind of getting through the bags of diapers first. Um, and of course, people will more than likely bring more diapers to the baby shower. So she'll be stacked up on diapers for a little minute. Babies go through diapers extremely fast. Uh, huggies, diapers, whatever, y'all. <laughs> So, anyways, let me go ahead and get some of this stuff put away, and I'm going to talk to y'all in a second. Yourself, you really moved 